For a couple of years, companies have been looking for ways to completely eliminate the bezels on smartphones. And we've seen a couple of clever solutions like the pop-up selfie camera, the rotating pop-up camera, the flip camera, and dual display phones. And a couple of more subtle solutions like the notch and punch hole camera cutout. But we can all agree that the perfect solution is to have the camera and all the sensors sit under the display. And companies have been working towards achieving this. We've seen a couple of prototypes from Xiaomi and Oppo, but no marketable device yet. Samsung was expected to launch the S21 series with the under display camera, but the tech wasn't ready for the S21 series. So that leaves us with the Galaxy Z Fold 3. According to Korean media, Samsung is aiming to introduce the under display camera with its next Galaxy Fold. The current Galaxy Z Fold 2 has an Infinity O panel which places the camera sensor in a display cutout which in itself is an improvement over the notch. But the under display camera wouldn't need a cutout. The camera will be placed under the panel, thereby providing a fully immersive, uninterrupted full screen experience. ZTE already showcased how the tech would work on a smartphone with its Axon 20 5G launched earlier this year. There's a lot of technology ensuring the camera and the display don't interfere with each other. When the camera is activated, the pixels around the display will be turned off and the camera will be able to receive light through the area in the display with the turned off pixels. But the image quality from the selfie camera on the Axon 20 isn't as sharp as the ones from other selfie cameras. So according to reports, Samsung Display is making the panel required for the under display camera, while the image sensor for the camera is being made by Samsung's system LSI division. So both the display and the camera will be designed specifically for the under display camera to work flawlessly. Samsung is also working to improve the output quality from this camera by developing a sophisticated image correction algorithm. So rest assured, the image quality from the under display selfie camera on the Z Fold 3 should be as good as what you'd get on your normal selfie camera. Anyway, let me know what you think about a wholeless, notchless, non-gimmicky, edge-to-edge full-screen display experience on the Z Fold 3. Drop a like if you enjoyed the video and definitely subscribe and hit the bell icon to get more tech-related videos. Thanks for watching guys, see you in the next one.